everyone welcome back to my channel my name is Jenny and if you're new here you're welcome oh my god I am literally nervous wreck right now as well as super duper excited this is what happened like two months ago we applied for citizenship of Australia and just last week I received an email saying invitation to citizenship interview and test so i'm gonna guide you through what's gonna happen how it's gonna go for the citizenship testing i have also been studying a book you're gonna have to read that book and then uh, the questions will come from that they give you like 45 minutes all right so without further ado let's start our day and get ready for my citizenship interview it also can help you in getting organized for your interview you never know when is your interview coming up and then you need to get organized let's get started with the vlog Let's make toast for breakfast. It's ready. It's very simple. A peanut butter and jelly. So this is the book I have been reading to prepare for my test. It's very easy and simple to go on the website and download and print it. It has all the information about Australian history and how the government works and yeah, everything we need to know about Australia. I'm just getting ready to get my workout done for the day because in the evening um, I probably be late so I don't want to like procrastinate so I'm just gonna get it done now yeah so I'm just gonna use my treadmill for the quick run So I just did my makeup. It's pretty subtle. I don't want to do it too much. It's basically interviews. So I still want to look very subtle, but yet uh, pretty. They are also taking photo over there. I don't know why, but yeah, they are. So I still want to look snatched and pretty and edgy. So I did this nice and clean makeup. So this is the fit for today. I kind of wanted to go for more like formal look. So I'm just wearing a crop top, a skirt, and pairing it with blazer, which kind of looks more put together. Yeah, and I'm just gonna add black trolley Nikes and then that will be my outfit for the day. So I also wanted to do what's in my bag today because uh, it's important what I take in my bag. I shouldn't be forgetting anything. So this is my bag. I bought this from Melbourne. It's so cozy. Um, if you haven't seen the Melbourne vlogs yet, um, there are three to four vlogs 
go to my channel and watch them i might link it in description as well um but yeah the melvin trip was so much fun okay let's get back to the vlog um so this is my bag i'm gonna pack it so first of all to take all my documents um all the legal documents are in here so that i can show it to them because they're gonna ask for them i don't want to miss out on anything or forget anything that's why i made a checklist and then checked all my documents put it in one envelope so it's ready to take that goes in my bag the next thing i'm going to take is just in case if i have time over there i'm gonna go through it again um because obviously we don't want to make any mistakes mm -hmm. so that goes in the bag water bottle most important because i know i'm gonna freak out so i'm gonna need that this bag also comes with this cute little wallet or a purse um so i can put all my small things in here like keys and lip balm and lip gloss things like that so first of all i'm going to take a compact and the brush just in case before the picture i need to touch on or something i don't know maybe so that goes in and my reliable dior lipstick i love it so much the lip gloss just in case I want to. yeah doesn't hurt found out that whenever i am around nice fragrance it literally calms my nerves down so this is going to be one of those situations where i'm going to panic or get stressed that's why i'm going to take my little handy perfume with me so i feel like oops it's coming i'll just open it put it on my wrist and i'll go and that will help me to get through the process so yeah that's it in my bag so i'm going to take my phone my wallet uh, and my car keys so that's still going in here um and yeah my little bag is ready okay i'm ready to go now <sighs> let's do this office is in the city. I'm gonna drive to the closest parking of the building and then I'll walk down because it might get hard to find parking in the city. <laughs> Finally found the parking! Number C. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's done! Oh my gosh, I'm done with the interview, done with the test. Obviously, smash the test. I was walking towards the parking, I also got an email saying it's approved that means i am officially citizen i can do my opera voice today yes i can <laughs> um very very quick there was no line i went in there checked in they gave me a ticket for counter i went to the counter the lady was super duper 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 sweet and she checked all my documents and then she said, okay, let's go for the testing. I went for testing. Again, the lady, other lady, was super, 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 super sweet. And she made me sit for the test. She said 45 minutes, but I smashed it like it. I don't want to, I don't want to brag about it, but yeah, very soon. Now, all I need to do is 
wait for the so i'm citizen but not citizen until i take the pledge and attend the ceremony i'm not officially citizen um so i'm kind of half citizen if this if that makes sense um so yeah we're gonna have to wait for the ceremony to happen and then we pledge and then after that um we can apply for australian passport so i am so thankful i am full of gratitude right now this day is so important for me i didn't want this day to become just usual or regular i really really wanted to romanticize this day my interview my test so that i can remember to remember it forever um the joy the gratitude i just want to keep it with me always that's why i made this vlog so that you guys can be part of my journey thank you for hanging out with me and it's time to celebrate and i will see you guys in my next vlog thank you